For those of you guys who are new to my channel, hi, my name is Violet, and I used to study in Ateneo de Manila University in the Philippines for uni, but now I will be studying abroad in the University of New South Wales with a degree in computer science. And this is a pack with me on what stuff I will be taking with me on my first year as an international student in Australia. So, let's get started. Okay, so it's January 23, so I have about less than two weeks before I'm leaving. So, what progress I made today is that I finished my winter clothes. I finished like packing most of them. So, I'll show you guys what I got. So, for winter, I have these, like, jackets that if it's not that cold in the winter, I can wear those. And these are, like, some thinner ones, just in case the winter is not that cold. And in case winter is extreme, I have this very fluffy jacket for my outerwear. And then, these are just my long sleeves that I'll just be putting on during the winter. Um... This jacket, uh, it's a denim jacket, so it would really suit during the autumn. And then here, I have some thick pajamas for the winter because I'm not sure how cold it will get. And um, this is my winter formal. And the rest here is just like my, <clears throat> sorry, my summer formal clothes and um, my summer jacket. So yeah. This is the progress. So right now, I'll just pack these clothes into a laundry bag and then put it in one of the luggages. So let's do that. Okay, all packed. Now let's put all my winter clothes in one luggage. All done! One luggage down for winter clothes! And now, it's just my summer clothes and my stationary stuff. So, yeah, at least there's progress. Okay, so it's um, January 26, which means I have less than a week to go before I fly out. And so today, we'll be focusing on stationary stuff. So I found this big box here. Um, I'm gonna put like most of my stationary stuff except for the bulky ones so that they won't be moving and they won't get damaged um, during the travel so my goal is just to f make sure it fails until here but then knowing me I have a lot of stationary <laughs> items so yeah let's see how it goes. So out of all my stationery, this has got to be the bulkiest and heaviest item I have right now. I currently finished um, packing it. So it's this study buddy 3-in-1 book stand that I really, really love that, I, that my parents got me for my birthday. If you don't know what's the study buddy 3-in-1 um, book stand, it's just like I post, I'll post a photo like right here. But yeah, this currently weighs 10 pounds. So... I'm very sure my luggage is going to be a bit overweight. Okay, so sorry for not updating you guys, but it's currently January 28th. I have about three to four more days um, to go. I just finished all summer clothes, so this is like 90% of my summer clothes. There are just some two, sh two pants and two shirts in the um, washing machine, but most likely I'll just be wearing them. So yeah, so this is mostly the pile. So I just have some towels here, like hand towels. And then this is like my bath towels. Shorts, of course, because it's hot in Australia for the summer. 
and I just have this um, very thin jacket just in case it might be a little chilly in their summer and then I have some sports shirts um, most of them are like the Ateneo merch shirts that I got on my last day just as a remembrance that I went to Ateneo for two years and these are just like all the other shirts like the out shirts yeah and these are my pajamas very thin pajamas and this one is the one from before these are just my formal gowns for the summer and of course i have a bathrobe and lastly i have these rash guard swimming suit and goggles which i'll put into this waterproof bag because um part of my tuition goes to like gym membership so i get access to the pool so i'm hoping to at least keep up swimming for at least like once or twice a week there Okay, so most of these are like stationary stuff, except for some small items here, which is personal hygiene, umbrellas, echo bags, wipes, and I'll just be adding some of my, my, more of my toiletries like around one to two days before leaving since I'm still using them. Um, this is like a self drying coaster, so handy to have it in the dorm. So most of these are stationary supplies, so like I have some notebooks here um refills um like spiral notebooks for practice notebooks um i have a labeler here because i need to label some stuff so i'll be bringing that and most of these are the pens and highlighters that can come in boxes yeah so i just organized it right here and then the ones that are in pieces um i just put it in like my pencil cases so i have one here this is my ateneo pencil case it's like a standing pencil case so i just got it as a memorability and then i also have more pens in here and also i have it in here so those are all my pens i just put them in pencil cases and i just plastic them so that the ink won't um spill to the pencil cases Right here, I have like folder and envelopes just used to organize my stuff. And then in this box, I just put some of the fragile ones. So like these, I just, those are my pen stands. So I just um, bubble wrap them so that they won't get damaged. But some small items, my hole punchers and stuff. So this is like most of my stationery. If I just miss, it might be just missing one or two small stationery, but yeah. So I'm just going to try fitting this in a luggage and let's see how it goes. Okay, so update. Um, I wasn't able to film me, um, me and my parents packing, but um, we got like three out of the four luggages full and 90, like 95% of our stuff is already in so i was able to fit most of my stationaries and they were below the weight limit um so right now the only thing we need to pack are maybe last minute summer clothes which is just around three pieces and um my travel backpack and my carry-on luggage and just the toiletries and then after that we're done yeah so big accomplishment today Okay, so I got some parcels from Shopee and Lazada for some dorm stuff and some of my school supply stuff. So I'll be opening that and we'll be bringing this to Australia since stationary coaster are pretty, pretty expensive. So let's do it. Okay, so I wanted to show you guys what I got. 
like for part of my dorm and some stationary supplies I got from Shopee Lazada. So first is my refills for correction tape since they're a lot cheaper here. This one only costed me around 75 pesos for two of these so it's really a steal already considering how much Mr. Whipper cost here. Next is these refill papers. I got them in 10 packs and each pack has 50 pieces. Um, they're the B526 whole papers and the 100 GSM papers that I tried out last semester and they were really really thick and very nice so i just got a bunch since they're very also very cheap and then here it's supposed to be clips for like um for kitchen stuff but i guess i can use this like if i open chips and also like to um to stick papers yeah <laughs> Because these are actually really sturdy and really nice. Um, next, I got some command hooks. So these ones are the jumbo ones and they can hold up to 3.4 kilos since I'll be using them for the dorm and hang some of my bags and ropes. So I just need it to be extra strong so it won't suddenly fall down. And then the last ones are like these notebooks. I have these in purple. Like this one in purple that I bought before and I liked it so I just bought it in blue and green but I don't think I'll take the blue I'm gonna actually ship it back to the seller because um, as you can see it's quite damaged when I open it so I cannot like take that because I spent money and I don't want it looking like that but there's just a small dent in the green one and so I'll just take it as is since I'm really in need for one more of this so yeah, this is a little mini shopping Zada haul I got for my dorm and for my school supplies. Okay everyone, it's January 31, 5.30pm, which means I have less than 24 hours before I have to leave. And these are like the last part of the luggage, so we'll be putting this in the last, um, in the last luggage. So technically, in terms of clothes and stationery and all dorm packing stuff, I'm like mostly done. The bulky items will just be bought near my dorm because we won't have space anymore. So right now, um, I haven't prepared my travel backpack and my carry-on, so I'll do it now. Okay, so update, um, I changed the hand carry because I just needed a smaller one. So technically, this one is all packed. I just forgot to make it a time lapse. But yeah, um, I'm done with everything. All the luggages are in the car. I'm done with my backpack and the hand carry. So I think I'm ready to go. So it's currently 1.30 a.m. And I'll just go get some sleep. And after that, it's flying time. So thank you so much for watching. And stay tuned for the next video, which is a dorm moving vlog.